I'm back on the bibliography for the um, article on Jonestown. Um, they call it Notes. Um, they give one of the nice things about Wikipedia is that they do give you some additional places to go for information. So they have this See Also section where they have um, a link to a documentary film and uh, some information on a show through the History Channel. They have this huge um, list of sources on this particular topic. Again, many, many books and articles. You could then go into the library and find these books or articles. So they have compiled in one place for you a lot of research done on this particular topic. And you would need to actually still go out and find these original sources, but at least you don't have to try and guess what's been published out there. And you'll see there's just been a huge amount of content published about this particular event. Um, they do have a list here of further reading. These all have ISBN numbers, so these are all books that have been written. And then they have, um, for many of their articles, external links, usually that go to other websites um, that have some kind of additional content, um, videos. Uh, so this one, Jonestown, The Life and Death of People's Temple, is a website for the film and includes video interviews with the survivors. Um, this is one that I find pretty interesting, the Jonestown death tape. Um, I'm going to take my headphones off for just a second so I'm not going to be able to talk to you, but uh, this is an audio file that was taken at the time that Jim Jones, the, the preacher for the People's Temple, um, was sort of forcing his followers to drink the um, poisoned Kool-Aid and commit mass suicide. Again, this was close to a thousand people that died um, in this particular event. So I'm going to put my microphone up to the um, speaker of my computer, which is pretty faint, but I'll let you listen to this for a second. Okay, I'm going to stop this there. But this is, but that's just an example. I mean, some when I listen to this, even uh, even now, I, I get goosebumps. Um, and there was a section of this uh, tape that was used in a, in a song that I really liked, um, and I didn't realize that this is where it came from until I listened to this tape. And I said, Oh my gosh, they sampled that in the song that I really liked. And it always kind of creeped me out, and now I know why. Anyway, these kinds of value-added extra types of audiovisual materials are often very powerful and they give you a better sense of understanding of, of a particular event. And so um, having all those links put in one place from Wikipedia is kind of a, a nice, um, you know, uh, value-added, <laughs> I keep saying that, I'm kind of having a, a moment where I'm not, my words aren't coming out exactly the way I'd like, but anyway, you get what I'm trying to say. Wikipedia does have some good points. I don't, I don't think that um, I, it would be a good thing to tell people not to use it. I use it all the time. It's just take what you learn there with a, with a grain of salt and be sure to um, verify your sources. If you quote anything that you find from Wikipedia, make sure that you quote the actual sources where those um, pieces of information came from.